Here with Jack Ashevsky. Jack, injured at the moment, mate. How's it coming along? Yeah, good. I had um, had a back operation about three and a half weeks ago. Had a uh, bulge disc, so I had to shave away the disc. Um, a bit different, not used to... Well, you know, I don't, don't know many footy players that have had a back op, so it was going into it was a bit nervous, but um, it's coming along well. Started my rehab program, which is all right. A big 2019 season for yourself. Reflecting on the year, what were you most proud of? Um... I thought I played pretty consistent footy. Uh, I did have to deal with some injuries through the middle of the year and was able to just find a way to keep playing. I thought the team overall did well, um, but yeah, I was just happy with the consistent footy I played. The injuries that you experienced, do you feel like it's a bit of a silver lining in terms of being able to persevere through that and come out the other side a much better player? Um, I remember when I was training in under-18s, we had um, Graham Eady as our coach and he said that you're probably never going to play a game not carrying injuries. So I suppose you're always carrying niggles, but you've just got to find find a way to overcome them and just yeah, just get, make sure you get on the field and do the best you can each week. Here at Emerging Blues Camp, what are you hoping to get out of today? Uh, it's good to just be in the mix. I'm getting a bit old. I'm 25. I thought I was closer to retirement than Emerging <laughs> Blues. But no, nah, um, nah, it just shows I'm still a chance, still in the mix. So good. Gives me hope. Gives me something to play for next year. How much confidence does, it, does that give you, knowing that um, you're getting recognised by Brad Fittler as a potential future blue? It must give you confidence moving forward into next year. Yeah, 100. percent It shows that you shows that you're close. It shows that they're obviously thinking about you and having a look at you. So um, doesn't put. I don't think it put pressures on you. It's exciting for next year, making sure that you play good footy, knowing that they'll be watching. You enjoyed a really good year, but what are your goals for 2020? Um, I'd like to probably get a starting position and. Just like I said, play consistent like I tried to do this year.